why would you want to go into a museum if outside was a ginormous social change was going on and inside was just a quiet river? Every person that comes off the ferry is going to be welcomed by BEMA. Bainbridge Island Museum of Art is committed to showing world-class art as well as connecting to our local and regional artists. BEMA's exhibition mission is to show and collect what we call the art and craft of the Puget Sound region. This is a really wonderful, supportive, diverse, curious, ever-changing community. It's accessible to everyone. And I think having those multiple entry points where you don't have to have studied fine art because what was unaccessible, I think to some, maybe even intimidating, um, BEMA creates entry points. When you're in the art museum, you have time to reflect and time to wonder. And I think in that wonder, that's where the healing, that's where you start thinking of what could be. Having these spaces, it's, it's such a treat for the community, you know, to be able to say a five-year-old can come here or an 85-year-old can come here. It's so funny, especially starting off, you know, most artists are like showing in a coffee shop or there comes a point where now, okay, now maybe I'm trying to get into a gallery. Bima has elevated my voice to a level that I could not do by myself. Being able to, be in a place so open, so um, modern, that it shows the work at a whole new level. We're dealing with the issues that society at large is dealing with. We're reckoning with our own histories. When we reopened, people came in and said, this is the first place I've been besides the grocery store or the doctor. Artists by nature, think outside of whatever systems and boxes. When you have diversity of thought and diversity of art and diversity of perspectives, what you're bringing is you're bringing new narratives. And anytime you're telling new narratives, you're telling new stories. Art serves to tap us into our humanity and then expose us to what could be. And even if sometimes those images are showing the darker and the lighter of possibilities of things. How often do you get the opportunity to talk to someone about uh, maybe politics or a subject that might be tough to talk about. With art, it allows a bridge for us to have a conversation about something that might otherwise we wouldn't talk about. It's not always about the piece of art. It's about serving the community, helping people live richer lives. Art can be a vehicle for, for doing that. Being a platform for the visual arts is, is actually engaging um, society in, in further conversations in a different way. It's not like a book that has a beginning and an end. Um, it's often the start of some kind of a journey on a topic for them. Going forward, I don't know how any art museum can operate without being in community. So rather than a museum, like I'm gonna make this and then hope it serves them, they are in relationship with the community and that guides the process because they're not trying to just create a, a menu and see who likes it, but they're creating relationship and reciprocity and a guiding vision that's in community. Listening and responding in a way that's active and not just performative, I think is really powerful. If people can walk in the door and have a feeling of wonder, that will be where we will find healing. Mm -hmm.